Chris Wojcicki, I know uh, there's a lot of conversations that are going on right now in the EU about um, uh, the way that uh, the governments are handling not only the current uh, issue with regard to security, but also with migration and the refugee movement. What is the nature of the relationship uh, of Jewish people in Slovenia? Um, you know, has there been a return of people? Obviously, there's a, a Maribor synagogue, which is important. But you know, in terms of the um, the nation of Slovenia, it, it seems to not be in the same situation as some of countries like France or Hungary that are <coughs> too far to the right, which aren't very welcoming. Uh, but Slovenians are known for being welcoming because we have to be in. It's who we are. Yes, I I do understand your question. But there wasn't a large uh, influx of uh, Jewish people into Slovenia uh, since, I would say, uh, if we go a little bit into the history, in the, in, uh, by Maximilian's rules, so his laws so of, of, of that area, Jews were banished from, from the lands that were, uh, that were also Slovenian lands at that time. So this was in, in 15 something, so it was in 16th century. And then in 18th century, they slowly began to uh, begin to come back with some of the reforms. And then in the in the 19th century, a little bit more. But then again, it happened that, as I was saying before, that the anti-Semitism in Europe at all started to really uh, boost in the in the start of the 20th century. And at that time, the majority of the Jewish population was kind of pushed towards the uh, towards two sides of Slovenia. So either in Trieste, so Terst, uh, which there is a, a little bit of a Jewish community, and in, in the most uh, northeastern part of Slovenia, where it's still uh, not large, but there is a Jewish community there. So between Italy and the Hungarian Austrian yes, border? Yes, 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 actually, to. From, from the center right. up to the, up to the <coughs> borders. But <laughs> otherwise, there, there was no uh, large uh, influx, even though we do have, in Ljubljana, we have a Jewish center, which uh, one of my friends and one of my students, actually, from the United States is uh, is living there, and then uh, Maribor Synagogue has the other, uh, the other one. Uh, so, we do have a lot of research on in that area, even though there is not a lot of uh, Jewish population.